Hey there, it's Katrina Sawa here, the Jumpstart Your Biz Coach with jumpstartyourmarketing.com. I want to talk to you about holiday marketing. Okay, so it's December. It's crunch time. You want to hit the end of the year with a bang and the biggest income year that you've had so far, right? That's what we all want, right? But what happens in December? Holiday parties, luncheons, you know, shopping expos, but not a lot of business networking goes on if you go around in your local area, right? So what do you do? Where do you find the right prospects that are actually willing to buy from you during December if you're not selling something holiday oriented, right? Or some kind of gift someone can buy. Uh, then, where do you go? What do you do? Well, I highly, highly suggest you look to social media. And there's a specific strategy that I teach on social media where, um, well, first of all, let me back up. The number one goal is to really get more people on the phone with you. Okay. In case you haven't thought of this, um, a lot of people out there like to do online marketing, right? Well, there's a lot of great things to be done in online marketing. And we just came out of you know Black Friday and Cyber Monday, and there's a lot of online shopping to be done during the holidays. But um, if your people are not online marketers, and they may not see your messages, right? And if you're selling something like a coaching program or something higher priced, right, um, more than a couple hundred bucks, they may not click and buy on your website for a couple hundred bucks. A lot of people have been burned, right, in the past. And for if they're going to spend a few thousand dollars or even a few hundred dollars, they might want to have a conversation with you first. So first I want to get you thinking, like, you got to have more phone conversations, right, in general. We can't rely on email marketing anymore because half the time, if not more than half the time, your emails go into the spam or trash folder, right? I just had somebody talk about that today, right before I started doing this video, that my video or my email went in her spam. She didn't see it. And so she didn't see it respond for like a week and a half, right? So we can't rely on email. We have to get on the phone if you want to sell, especially if you want to sell high ticket programs, products, or services, or anything really over a few hundred dollars. Because think about it. Do you trust every Tom, Dick, or Harry that has a website out there that offers some schwanky program that sounds like it's the best deal on the planet for you uh, right now and gives you this super special bonus price by today? No. We don't trust everybody, right? A lot of us have gotten burned. A lot of us have bought things that weren't what they said they were, or they just sit on our on our virtual shelf, right? So honestly, I mean, you just got to get on the phone. So it's a great time to, number one, call through your database. Go pick up your, your list of contacts, print it out into a printout, and just start dialing. Dialing. You don't necessarily have to go make a sale or make an offer or be salesy in that conversation. But talk about the holidays. Get to know your subscribers more. It's the time to build relationships, right? Um, but when you, and so on social media, going back to social media, what you want to do is you want to get more people. You want to get in front of more people that you don't necessarily know. First of all, yes, you can reach out to the people you are already connected to on social media. And reach out with a private message. Say, hey, Jane, we've been friends for a while now. I don't really know too much about what you're doing in your business, or I don't know too much about you. I wonder if you might want to come to a phone conversation and see if or how we can help each other, right? And that gets the ball started. And a lot of people will take you up on that call information. Not everybody, but that's okay. That don't, don't let that stop you because not everybody pays attention. On, not everybody pays attention anyways. That's a period right there. Pay attention, right? So you just have to keep reaching out. It's a quantity. It's a numbers thing. you got to reach out to as many people as humanly possible that you can reach out to on social media to try to um, entice them into having a conversation with you over the phone or Skype or Zoom or something like that. And then see what happens. You might find that they want to buy your stuff. You might find that you want to buy their stuff. You might find that it might be a good joint venture opportunity. You might be able to speak on a podcast of theirs. You don't know what's going to happen until you actually have a conversation. So get more personal. Pick up the phone and reach out to people one by one to try to schedule conversations. And I think you'll find a lot more success this month during the holidays instead of just the blanket emails and the blanket social media posts. Get more personal, okay? Uh, it should work for you if you do enough of it. Don't just do a couple people here and there. That's not going to be enough. 
Okay, we're talking mass marketing, mass quantities of relationship marketing activity here. And I tell you, it works for dozens and dozens of my clients who do it on a regular basis. It works for me when we turn on the marketing hose in that, in that way, and it can work for you too. So if you want more information about how I can help you jumpstart your business in general and really help you prioritize focus, plot out your big picture plan, think of what you're doing in your business models and what you're selling, come to a call with me, okay? You can come to a call with me, right? And a lot of times I can't even shut up and I'll, I'll probably give you some grand idea or advice that can help you right away. You know, it's not... You know, it's not about sales. It's about relationship building. So come to a call with me this month, too. Go to askcat.biz, A-S-K-K-A-T dot B-I-Z. But hurry, because my calendar's almost full. No, no. No joke there. <laughs> um, but I want I want to talk to those of you who are really serious about building your business this year and uh, want to make some big changes to make some bigger money and make a bigger impact. Have a great day, everyone.